So, I don't know about you guys, but I've been eating chips and salsa every single day for the past week. So, I decided to do some meal prepping this week, show you guys everything that I'm going to be eating for the next week, including breakfast, lunch, dinner, some decently healthy options. They're not the healthiest, but they're better than chips and salsa. So, I hope you guys enjoy and maybe cook with me. All right, enjoy the vlog. <laughs> Good morning! <laughs> wonderful day to be alive. I want to be Whitney Simmons. Make sure to watch her YouTube channel Whitney. She is the like most ultimate girl supporting girls. I just feel like her because I'm wearing a gym shirt. What a beautiful day it is to be alive. That's what she says. <laughs> but listen up. Today we're going to be working out. We're going to get our life together. I have some brand deal photos I need to take. going to take some pictures for Secret. Love my girls at Secret. And I don't know why. I just am in a dancing mood. I just want to dance. Poo, poo, poo. So I don't know. Maybe we can like learn a dance after to the workout. Okay, this is so random, but I have been wanting to learn some YouTube dance tutorials just to like, when the clubs open up, just to like pop out a new dance move, you know what I mean? So, oh. oh my god, also so random, my AirPods came in the mail and they had free engraving. Oh wait, I showed it in an unboxing, but like, you couldn't really see it. Look how cute it is. Are you kidding? Oh my god. Oh, oh. Also, every time I come in my room, I just admire. Oh, Bob the Builder, who really? I just need to get my water, my gas booting gas. I keep her near my cereal. Which my wildflower phone case is going to be launching August 14th, and my back to school water bottle and bullet journal are going to be launching on the 21st of August. Oh! You know when you work out so good that you just knock out right after? So that was me. <laughs> I knocked out right after, it's the next day, and I thought, you know what? Let's just do some meal prepping. Okay. Ignore my kitchen, my kitchen's a mess. I wanna start off with dinner, cause I wanna eat. I am starving right now. So I'm gonna be making Sierra's bowl that she taught me how to make. It's just a salmon bowl with rice. Oh, it's so good. Oh, hello there, voiceover. <laughs> Apparently, when I cook, I don't like to talk. It just feels weird. I just wanna live in the moment. So I'm gonna teach you guys everything from start to finish everything that I made for my week starting off with dinner which is my salmon sushi bowl Sierra actually taught me this basically what you're gonna need is some rice vinegar salt maple syrup sesame oil soy sauce salmon sesame seeds and a half ripe avocado so I just started off by cooking the rice according to the packet it just said I think it said like 20 minutes it would be finished and if you want you can roast the sesame seeds but I don't prepare the salmon so mine already comes in chunks and I'll add some maple syrup sesame oil oil, garlic, about to make it nice and spicy. Not spicy, nice and flavorful, you know what I'm saying? And then I cook the salmon for just a couple minutes, just however much you like it. And then you put the rice in the bowl, you put the salmon in the bowl, you cut up the avocado, you pour on some of the sesame seeds, and boom, you got yourself a very beautiful, delicious meal. And dude, it literally takes about like 20, 30 minutes to make it super easy and super tasty. Good morning, it's the next day, but we're gonna continue meal prep breakfast and lunch. I want to start off with breakfast. Next up, we got the most important meal of the day, breakfast. I decided to do these breakfast oatmeal cupcakes to go. And this should only take 25 minutes for 25 cupcakes. Basically, what you're going to need are some rolled oats, bananas, hello notifications, salt, maple syrup, aguave, or honey, mini chocolate chips, water, vegetable oil, vanilla extract, and cinnamon. Okay, now what you're gonna wanna do is preheat the oven to 380 degrees Fahrenheit, and then in a mixing bowl, you should combine all the dry ingredients and the wet ingredients separately. But I'm a dumb bitch and I forgot, so I just did it all together. You're not supposed to, but I did. Once you mix them all together, mix them all together, na 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 na. That's what it's all about. That's the hokey pokey, right? You pour all of them into the cupcake liner. They can overflow a bit because they don't have flour, so they're not gonna rise. Gonna put it in the oven for, I think, 11 minutes. Bake for 21 minutes. So I'm thinking I'm gonna do like 19 because I don't want to burn them and then bake for about 21 minutes I thought that I could do under but no girl it took me like 25 minutes just let them cool overnight and oh they taste like real cupcakes and they're so good in the morning this is the best part about cooking is eating what's left over 
Mm. I mean, it's no cookie dough, but it's healthier. You guys know I always talk about how I want to drink less coffee. So one thing that really helps me is just meal prepping some matcha. So what you're going to need is some milk. I just have some almond milk, some matcha, and some vanilla syrup. Basically, you put the milk, the matcha, and the vanilla syrup in a mason jar and mix it all together. I don't have any measurements. I just kind of eyeball it, and it's so good. You could add more vanilla syrup depending on what you like. I even like to add honey. Another thing that I... Sorry, I'm watching the Hunger Games. Another thing that I like to do is write affirmations or just manifestation. I like to put that in my matcha. I just got it from this tweet that I retweeted. She followed me on Twitter. And then for breakfast slash lunch, whatever snack I want, basically I'll hard boil some eggs, I'll throw in some grapes or some carrots, some apples, some cheese, some pita bread, and some peanut butter. And basically you have almost all of the food groups in one. It's a really good snack. Have one of these, you're good for the day. <laughs> and yeah, that's pretty much what I made for this week. But yes, I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. <laughs> it's the next day and I forgot to end the vlog. I literally just ate and then passed out. You know when food is so good? Oof, I passed out two times in this vlog i just realized once from working out once from eating Whew. but if you guys didn't know i have a case collab coming out with wildflower and you guys can actually click the link down below and you could sign up to be notified when the case goes live but it's going live on friday at 11 a.m pacific standard time 2 p.m eastern standard time and it looks like this and i'm so in love with it i just like i went for this 70s design and i, I don't know i bring my phone everywhere with me so i just seeing something bright and colorful with all my favorite colors pink orange yellow just makes me happy and I don't know. I just really love it. So make sure to click the link down below if you guys want to get it. Mwah. I can't believe it's coming out. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Let me know if you do some meal prepping. Let me know in the comments below or tag me if you guys ever do it. Do you like these health videos or am I just being annoying? I remember like a couple years ago, I get annoyed every time someone would post like a workout video. I'd be like, we get it. Because I would never work out. And I'd be like, we get it. We, I don't want to see this. <laughs> but if you guys actually want to see it, I could do more. I feel like especially during this quarantine, I've been taking a lot of care of my body and just eating better. Meal prepping helps me eat better because if I don't meal prep, I'm gonna eat chips for the day and working out and stuff like that. So let me know. But I know a lot of the time, like these food videos or workout videos can be inspiring or motivating. It does that for me, at least right now. So let me know. Let me know in the comments, we can chat. But today's merch shout out of the day goes to Diana on Instagram. She has her wine. Oh, it's one of those nights where you're just reading, having a glass of wine, wearing your girl sporting girls. <laughs> Which a lot of you guys have been asking my bullet journal and my hydro flask will be launching on the 21st So this wildflower case is launching this Friday. These are launching next Friday Lots of things are coming out and then today's tip of the day goes to lo-fi vibes on Instagram They just tag me. That's how you become tip of the day Their tip of the day says you aren't selfish for putting yourself first I feel like as a society we teach women especially young women that you have to love someone you have to nurture a baby You have to nurture your husband or your boyfriend or your mom or your parents or whatever we never talk about women taking care of ourselves and how are we supposed to put love into someone else when we can't even love ourselves we definitely have to love ourselves first before loving anyone else loving yourself and putting time towards yourself meal prepping working out doing things that make you happy having a morning routine and a night routine does not make you selfish if anything it makes you more capable of loving other people and yeah i hope that you guys enjoyed today's vlog i'll see you guys in my next daily vlog tomorrow same place same time love you guys bye <laughs> give my case save it on a roll for me bye <laughs>